Ladies and gentlemen, dear participants, excellencies, uh, it's a great honor for me to speak in front of you at such a unique and uh, esteemed International Women Conference. I would like to use this opportunity in order to extend my gratitude for the invitation to be among you. Conducting this type of international conference significates a victory of over long years of dominating stereotypes and gives hope and confidence to most women all of, over the world. The topic of our session is very actual. What we observe in the world today, violence, conflicts, sufferings, and hardships. Women and children are first who suffer most of all. How could we find a balance and a harmony in the changing world? Certainly, nobody tells to change the basis of society. Despite of the differences in nationalities and religions, each of us could make an input to the preserving peace and tolerance by using our wisdom. We must learn how to respect and start such a dialogue when everyone can talk and listen to each other. Women could play an active role in this process. I would like to inform you about the development challenges, hopes, and expectations of Azerbaijani women. Every stage of the Azerbaijani national self-consciousness is characterized by putting unique and talented women in the forefront. Already in 1918, Azerbaijan women got equal political rights with men. Even so, they, uh, their development has faced different types of difficulties depending in, on the centuries. Azerbaijani women uh, were able to defend their rights. First of all, the collapse of a huge totalitarian system and the gaining of independence in very difficult conditions, along with changing in society, formation of new values and the conflict has had a great impact on the development of women. At the point, the issue was not only providing for the advancement of women, but also bearing new, greater responsibilities, as well as participating in society's life in different ways. Azerbaijan women know what conflict means. The initial period of independence was connected with the beginning of military aggressions against Azerbaijan, aggravation of the Karabakh conflict, as a result of which we have thousands of ruined human lives, women who left their homes and lost their children. Azerbaijan women tried to use tradition of casting a head carf as a symbol of mercy between two fighting parties to prevent bloodshed and uh, hostility right away. Unfortunately, these traditions hasn't worked during the escalation of the modern conflict. 
This woman could uh, withstand, go through horrors of the war and loss of relatives. Out of one million of our citizens who left their native lands, 156,000 refugees and 300,000 of internally displaced persons are women. A great work is being carried out today for the reintegration into the society. Into the society. Despite of all difficulties and hardship, Azerbaijan government has created favorable conditions for promoting gender balance in employment, health, education, economic and social policy. For elimination of discrimination against women, government has reviewed uh, its laws, policies, programs to ensure that they don't in any way uh, deny equal enjoyment by women of their civil, political, economic, social and cultural rights. We should remember that we could not make any change by using violence. Violence leads to more violence. Society itself should be open to the new change and necessity of the implementation. For example, we conducted country-wide awareness raising campaigns and public debates before adoption of such important laws as the law on uh, guarantees of gender equality, law on combating domestic violence, and the law on amendments to the family code to bring the age of marriage to 18 for both men and women, amendment to the criminal code on prohibition early and forced marriages. If we met misunderstanding and a kind of resistance to some reforms in gender policy, at the first stage, uh, now we see change in public perceptions of the existing problems. Today, as a result of the well-balanced international social economic policy of our country, we have become a strong independent state. In order to resolve women's problems, several state programs with gender components have been approved in Azerbaijan. For example, the state program of poverty reduction and sustainable development, development concept Azerbaijan 2020, the vision of the future, the national program for action to raise effectiveness of the protection of human rights, state program on Azerbaijani youth national strategy on combating uh, domestic violence. They are all aimed at ensuring and promoting the rights of women and achieving their full development and advancement. This program contains a set of measures aimed uh, at ensuring women's employment, including fostering women's entrepreneurship, wide application of flexible forms of work for women, for better reconciliation of family and career, and stimulation on their work and economic sector. All these measures have brought to the economical independence of women. Despite of special uh, mentality of our women and their closeness uh, to their family and children, Azerbaijan women uh, becoming economical independent uh, got an opportunity to participate actively in the public and political life. Today, women in Azerbaijan use all opportunities provided by the state, easily obtain education, raise their professional level, and actively participate in social political process. They are widely represented in such areas as politics, uh, entrepreneurship, healthcare, sports, army, national security, and law enforcement bodies. Women are more and more involved in the decision-making process and state bodies. 
Today in the Republic, a share of women among state officials, uh, just professor and teacher, staff of high educational institutions, doctors, entrepreneurs, uh, sportswomen, and even Olympic champions is great. The support uh, of uh, First Lady uh, in our country, uh, President of uh, Foundation Haider Aliyev, very big help us. Alongside with her important missions, uh, being a prominent uh, public uh, figure, uh, heading the uh, Haider Ali Fund, the, she conducted a number of projects in the field of assisting uh, indigenous uh, people, especially women, children, and elderly. What is the role that women play in the modern Azerbaijan society today? They are very active. It's very hard in such a short time to have a full picture of an Azerbaijan, Azerbaijani woman. But if you ask me, what makes the living of Azerbaijani woman today? I'll answer that they, as all women on the planet, want to live in peace and harmony, dream of prosperity and well-being of their families, want to see their children healthy and happy. I will not make a mistake calling these values uniting all of us, women of the world. Let us work together to change this world. Thank you very much for your attention. And thank you for first time experience as a speech without sh shoes. It is very comfortable. Thank you. <laughs>